To my 63 subscribers and counting. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am back with another video. It's Usna Zodiko, aka your soul sister. Thank you for tuning in and for joining me. If you are new to the channel, please uh, hit the subscribe button. And if you are a returning sabi, thank you so much. If you like the video, please give it a huge thumbs up and leave a comment down below because today we are about to get into it. Um, the reason why I felt compelled, okay, yeah. So the reason why I felt compelled today to do this video was because I was seeing a whole lot of comments that disturbing <laughs> the trenches, disturbing comments that I saw floating around um, by black women because of a video that went viral by a girl called Nicole. I think I want to go on her Instagram. Actually, I went on her Instagram because I wanted to see why is she trending. I saw the video, but I just had to go on her Instagram to check why is she trending and like why are people so bothered by what she said. <laughs> oh, and you know, today I'm going to need for all the girlies at the back to come to the front seats because mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. today I did wake up and chose violence so um to give you a bit of a backstory, there is a video that's circulating, that's trending by Uniko and her friend, I think it's Lelo, I think the YouTuber is Lelo and Uniko was the friend that was featuring on the channel, okay, and they were doing a sip and spill, you know? so I think Ulelo asked her friend Uniko, <laughs> Ulelo asked her friend Uniko, but what is the definition of a broke guy to you? And then Uniko goes to explain her preference. Right? That Yena, she doesn't date broke niggas. And Funege, he must earn 50k and above. Not a problem. Um, what I want to get into is the comments that women were leaving under the video okay not necessarily under lelo's youtube page but just the comments that people were making towards this video and it baffles me like it really baffles me by now why are women so mad and i actually want to read you guys's comments because at this point you guys are hating you are hating on women that have standards you are hating on women that want more for themselves you are hating because there's no reason for you to hate the first comment is saying um lol it's it's her okay the first comment says it's the entitlement for me what is her salary how much is she earning maybe you can take it from there my first question would be to this person why do you care how much she earns do you base your worth on how much you earn at work as a woman do you base your worth on how much you get it sunny ends around and then um someone else says just say you love drug dealers lala and will understand because a nine to five gent is in your type this 2k generation is fucking unnecessary pressure for the gram Sweetie, <laughs> it's not all drug dealers that are making loads and buckets of money. It's a whole lot of people that are out there like getting it, you know? Like there's men that earn so much money without doing shady work. What makes you think that all the guys that are rich or making money are drug dealers? 
just a misconception in here just your reality is absurd because they on your otibana it's always the broke girls who are ready to spot broke men many girls don't go around labeling men as broke the shouters will shock you not even 10k in their account yo hi guys and this speech is really problematic guy as women mamela you really took out time and your data to go and defend men men in south africa innocent on your ot and what does she bring to the table entitlement can you call men hi babo I don't know what the hell she's saying she's saying she's asking what does nicole bring to the table did you see that ass did you see that nyash did you see that body <laughs> sometimes 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 make it pure because I am jealous of other women. Every day when Zalom Tanas until you find healing. Because there is no excuse, there is no way that all these women are defending men. Why aren't you letting men fight their own battles? It's her body, it's her vagina. when she says things like that maybe you secretly want to say it but I was because I was not or do you have issues where you told but you are not worthy of getting someone that earns more than 50k are your standards so low that you think om your umtana when they want um someone that earns so much money they they shouldn't then the benta tanga you get my other videos gatekeepers of success you know a lot of black women are gatekeepers of success like you don't want to see other women being happy you don't want other women to see, you don't want to see other women being spoiled you hate the idea of seeing other black women just living a soft life i remember when there was a trend there was a vibe your soft life you guys were attacking that and then there was a luxury black girl thing going on you guys were attacking that tell me where is a black woman supposed to thrive and just be in her feminine energy and relax in her femininity hi different ones because i feel like you guys are the reason why women aren't being themselves like you're the reason why women don't want to help other women is because nine attack mentality nine hating yourselves mentality and you need to get it together you need to get it together because this is not the vibe we are bringing into 2022 it's not we're not doing that let men fight their own battles let men drag nicole okay when if you're a woman sit this one out learn the art of minding your business because unico was not addressing you she was not addressing you not nina it cannot be you not nina defending men hi 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 if there's one thing that I could learn from Nicole's video is to lift up my standards like if I could learn because like if you're watching something you can choose to take out the negativity or the positive message in it in every situation guys learn to take out the positive even if something bad is happening in your life learn to take out the positive so like when I watch that video even if she didn't phrase it right even if maybe sorry even if maybe her way of saying it was not politically correct she still sent the message and 
this is where as a woman you practice discernment you practice wisdom you practice being intelligent know that umdupa etheta there's a message in between the lines you don't just look at them and feel like oh they are rude she's trying to tell you lift up your standards you are worthy like come on i like why are you bothered by her confidence why are you bothered you know ah uh-uh, guys sami enza lento okhulani ngoko nibadala food and you know what's so crazy is that abantu that left those comments kabantu abadala and you know what there's no way that ngabantu abadala aba happy aba ya kabantu abadala aba miserable you are miserable that when ngoko oyinta ngakani call you wanted to get 50k on my phone oh you make me laugh me and the shakies just a few weeks just a, f- a few days ago beni city u gogo maweni whoever that gogo is was fixing the country <laughs> you need double standards you have double standards and stop wanting to see another woman suffer because that's the reason why you don't want to call to her standards for herself that's why it has you at a chock hold by city and for 50k is because you hate the idea of seeing another woman living life you want to see another woman suffering no sorry don't do that don't do that pray for a better life pray for a better heart fix your ways so that now way there can be a light in your life Not everyone is as, is aspiring for the same life. Let's talk about that. How about we talk about that? No one is aspiring for the same life. We don't all want the same things. And it's okay. It's completely okay if you want to be somewhere in your life. That's good. If you want to be this side of your life, that's great. But uh, the moment you come in in someone's lane to tell them what is it that they need to demand out of life for themselves, then you bring pr- problematic then you are being problematic because ngokuwena ufuna wena ufuna ulandu udictator funu dictator ba umuntu makathi ngoba ombake mm sweetie mm that is not the way that is not how you should act as a woman relax just relax relax sweetie mm So that's all I have for this video. I just felt like I needed to bring my two cents into this because we need to change the mindset as an I as women. The mindset of suppressing each other, the mindset of um bring each other down, the mindset of jealousy like there is enough space for us to thrive this earth this universe is so abundant it is beautifully abundant there is enough for everyone to go around and get and another point that i wanted to make is that this men that sponsor only call this men that sponsor only call the lifestyle yeah bo they don't mind they like it like that they prefer it like that so it's all now my mind man be like those men that don't care to give a woman 100k or even a million rand be like them those men they don't care they want to do that for those women so so bad bothered and even if u theta ngabantu aba broke that she wouldn't date still so mind because u theta is so sad you not the broke man are you so why foolish are the need to comment hey man guys can is fundisen uba ngamantu ngazana sifundisene uba uba womanly sifundisene uzithanda man nike le nto yena solo koni ngizicutha stop reducing yourselves honestly stop y'all got me fucked up anyway that is it for the video <laughs> thank you for making it until the end 
iya bulela intumbi asema kusebeni umamu ne make sure that you subscribe to the channel make sure that you like the video please leave your comments and tell me what you think and Mamela, I know the haters that don't agree are gonna come for this video, but I do not care a damn. And Katali, people need to get this message, and women need to understand that we we on a different level of thinking and we can't go back, we can't reduce ourselves, you know. And until the next video, I thank you for all the support that you've been pouring to this channel i thank you for your likes for your comments i thank you for subscribing to the channel i thank you just for everything that you do for sharing my videos i thank you and i thank you and i thank you yabulela and ombi yase manonen bye bye